Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Orange Couch Crush, the show where we sit down with fellow Davis colleagues and other industry leaders and ask them a few questions. You know, try to get to know them a little better. Today we're super excited to have the man with the remote start plan, Mark Dalton. Welcome to the couch, Mark! Woo! Woo! Alright, for our first question, how long have you worked at Davis? 20 plus years. How comfortable is the orange couch on a scale of one to 10? Three and a half. <laughs> Why? It's too short. <laughs> I agree. How did you get started in the industry? My father was a carpenter, so I could build boxes. That's how I got started. If you knew how to build boxes in the 80s, when there was no prefab boxes, you were very valuable to the shop that you were at. So I had a friend that worked for a retail shop and none of those guys knew how to put a box together. And he said, hey, I got a guy who knows how to put four pieces of wood together and cut a hole in it. That's how I got my start. I had zero 12 volt experience when I started. How did you get so good with remote starts? Repetition. You don't get good unless you make some mistakes and I made a lot of them but you learn from your mistakes. Is it true you are a breakdancing ninja? Absolutely true. <laughs> well, I was a breakdancing ninja because I knew karate, and I also was a breakdancing gorilla because I worked at a balloonogram place when I was younger, and I knew how to breakdance. So, a breakdancing ninja karate gorilla. Are you a Magic the Gathering champion? Yes and no. I am very good. Champion, not so much. <laughs> Gym and returns can, can kick my butt pretty good. I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> so, we hear you're going to be a grandpa soon. How excited are you? Uh, on a scale of one to 10, about a 20. Oh. Yeah, we're, we're really happy. That's so nice. Congratulations. Thank you. Do you believe in ghosts? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Straight out, no. I promise you, darling, there's no ghosts around here, so you're safe. What is your favorite Thanksgiving dinner side dish? Oh, that's a good one. It's going to be fried sweet potatoes with sugar caramelization on them. White sugar, and you have to do it in a cast iron skillet in bacon grease. So what you do, you boil the potatoes, get them soft, then you dredge them in sugar, and then you fry them in bacon grease and, and about halfway up the, the potato. That's my mama's recipe. You talk about my mama. Mama's wrong again. <laughs> no kind of sandwich, you're wrong. Mama's right. Is Rudy your wiener dog? Rudy is my wiener dog. No one in particular. I didn't name Rudy, my daughter did. Not after the Notre Dame player. Not after Rudy <laughs> Taliani, no. So, what's your wiener cat's name? Wiener cat? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what you're asking there. What's a new brand or product that you're feeling right now? You know, I am really feeling the Blaupunt e-bikes. I think those things are, are really cool and I've been talking to a lot of people about the bike. The, those, are, those are cool. Are you going to get one? Chances are yes. I figure. <laughs> if you found a magic lamp and a genie came out and gave you just one wish, what would you wish for? Wow, just one wish. Health for my family. Beautiful. And our last question, do we live in a simulation? Do we live in a simulation? I would say no. No one can simulate what we go through. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good answer. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on the Orange Couch Crush, Mark. Thanks. David sure loves you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Woo!